PDF marks, the new PDF to InDesign and PDF to Publisher and PDF to Court, et cetera, uh, standalone application. I think Love excellent, Thank excellent. You. Necessary part of my day-to-day -day workflow. That's what we love to hear right off the bat. That's perfect. Or was that I had a hard drive crash. And mm, yeah. Everybody knows that that <laughs> really sucks. And and if you're trying to piece things together um, from from what files you have, you've got a PDF here, or you've gotten it from somebody else that you sent it to. Um, um, being able to turn that back into an InDesign file right. is valuable. Yeah. So all you have left so, is that so, PDF. Yeah. Yeah, and, um, and it was incredible. Like just the one week that I didn't have my primary machine, like I needed to go to my IT department, and I was like, I need another license for the you know the PDF marks and the and design marks. You know, like they are such a like you know like you don't realize like like they say you don't realize how much you need something until you don't have it and. I, I had a PDF, but I didn't have the original document. And I was amazed when I opened it up with, with uh, Mark's PDF that it's on the thing, the bleeds were still there. The, and this, it, would, it was like I was opening the InDesign file. The text all landed where it was supposed to go and everything was in the right place. Yeah. And so I was so thankful to have that. Wow, so, awesome. So a product like this, is, is amazing. Thank you, David, for for um, for Mark's work. Well, oh, you're welcome. Thank you to our engineers. And uh... so I had this map, right? So if I take, so if I do what the average Joe Joe does, it just opens this in Illustrator. It appears to open fine. But what if I had him edit this type that said the, the gulp, like a big gulp? Um, you know the gulp of region, right? Mm -hmm. So if I click on this, I can see that every letter is actually, you know, individual on a path. Right? Yeah. So there is no, you know, I'd have to retype it. Oh, yeah. And once you move it, it's out of position. And yeah. what a pain in the neck. Right? Yeah. So, yeah. you know, you could do that. You could struggle <laughs> you know, in your workflow, but no, with, PDF to InDesign or PDF Mark, so now you could export it to, like if I, ex I could export it to um, Illustrator and everything would still be text on a path, but I prefer to work in the layout application of InDesign, so if I just drag this into PDF Marks and I open this up and I get a nice little preview page of my document, um, and then I can choose to export this to InDesign. There we go. The auto load for the fonts. <laughs> Look, if I go here. My oh yeah! Right on. Wow, yeah. Right. So. Yeah. Beautiful. So that that is like, you know, that right there, like, just says it all. Like, it's a lifesaver. Yeah. You know? like, wow. You can't, you can't put a price on like, you know, like your time and your, you know, your you know, productivity. I mean, there's a point where, like, you know, recreating something is part of your job, but you don't want to spend, you know, tons of time, like, recreating stuff that you don't have to. Like, the whole the whole point of, like, the productivity and the scripting and the stuff that I do is you want the designers and you want the people that are actually, like, designing and creating from the floor up to, have, you know, to be able to spend more time to, you know, for the creative, for the whole creative process to happen. Right, because uh, you know PDF marks also extracts images. You ever use it just to get at the images uh, inside a inside a PDF? Definitely, definitely. So real quickly, I just wanted to point out that one of the questions that the production editor had about this map was that the bevel on it, you know, was created with low res raster settings in Illustrator. Which oh yeah, is a common state like you set your raster settings to like 72 dpi and then you save your pdf and the you know any kind of like blur or drop shadow or bevel effect is going to have a low res setting 
but like if these were images, and another beautiful thing about PDF marks is not only does it make a box folder for you, but it collects the images. Maybe that's all I know. You have to get. But being able to open it in, in PDF marks and be able to get the, the images out of there, that's, that's a lifesaver as well because there's so many documents that we've used um, over the years, um, whether it's reporting and we have pictures of, of care points or maybe there's a child in there that, that we wanted to highlight their story, um, then then we can get the original photo out of there instead of having somebody have to say, well, no, I just took a screenshot of it. This is the best I could get. Yeah, awesome, awesome. Okay, excellent. So I always ask this to everybody I interview. Would uh, would you recommend PDF Marks for people considering purchasing it? 100%. I, th I think it works so well. Um, I, I've never had... Um, a PDF that I've tried to open that it didn't work, and I'm always able to get the result that I'm looking for from, from Mark's PDF and, and from your previous versions. 100% uh, recommend it. Yeah. Excellent. Well, they thank were you. real life, and Mark's Rare, Mark's Rare was a real world, you know, production saver. You know, this week for me, like had it was like I had to have, like you know, like. When they when they ask you like when you fill out um, things that like you need for your workflow, you know like they're like you know wants or like must have like Mark's Rare for me is like a must have like for my workflow like and, you know otherwise I'm gonna spend hours like you know tripped up recreating things stumbling circling back in emails looking for like original content you know like, like when boom I could just get the job done yeah you know yeah get the job done. I was just thinking if anybody is in a position where, where they're uh, doing this kind of work and they're looking for tools um, and, and if they're considering uh, PDF marks or the alternative of uh, just just trying to do your best to scrabble a piece together, um, it, it's no question that you'll get better results with. You, you'll definitely get better results with marks PDF. Wow. Um, and so, so I absolutely encourage everybody that is doing this sort of work to, to work with, right. with Mark's PDF. Thank you. Yeah, excellent. And I, you need a conversion, everything will be fine. Hit the button, get converted, it's easy as pie. You think a long ago, it makes you wonder why. Now you're talking misverted while you stare at the sky. Where, 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 where,